Hey guys, so I wanted to do a review. I just picked up a uh, a base. I've had a couple bases in my life. I'm not very good at it. I'm still learning how to play. Uh, just for fun, I was at the neighbor's house and he said, uh, he asked if I played guitar. And I said, interesting, you should ask, because I'd been thinking about it. And he mentioned that he had a guitar, and another neighbor down the road had a guitar. And I mentioned that I used to play bass, because I just liked playing bass. I don't really know what I'm doing yet. And he said, good. We want somebody that plays something different. It'd be fun. So, I went. Uh... To a couple shops in the area. I'm fortunate enough that in my city I've actually got a couple of uh, big name uh, music stores in the area. So I went shopping around there and they had bases. I found a pretty cool one for about 150 bucks. Uh, it was a used Squire. Um, it was pretty cool. It had some road rash on it. it was, um, pretty cool. It was white, well, off-white, not really wanting a white base, but uh, but it was a good price, and I'd thought about it, and then uh, I thought, hey, why don't I look on Amazon? And, uh, well, let me, uh, I'm going to try to show you what I found if I figure it out. If I don't, you won't see it. It's, uh full-size Davidson base not the best quality in the world but comes with an amp a bag and all that good stuff and uh well let me show it to you okay so yeah kinda cool full-size and uh doesn't uh Play too badly. Didn't come uh, in tune. I, I fortunately have a tuner from before. And, uh, well, it, uh, couple things. Um, I'll show you the amp in a second, but uh, it's $129.95, and it's on Amazon Prime. Ordered it, all came in one box. Um, for a starter bass and for a bass, just to tool around, because I'm not going to be in a band or anything, just to learn and practice with and everything, it's uh, not bad. It's a plastic body. It's got a tone knob, volume knob. Tone knob has some problems. It's turned all the way down. And uh, see if you can hear what happens when I turn it all the way up. Yeah. Do you hear that buzz? The buzz is not good. So I just keep the tone knob turned all the way down, and we're fine. That's a. Uh, no buzz without the tone, so I'm right with that. Um, two pickups, one volume. Um, decent, easy to uh, string. The knobs are pretty, pretty good. Solid metal, which I was surprised about. I was expecting these to skimp out. It's got some plastic washers holding on, but that shouldn't be too bad. Um, for what it is, pretty happy. 130 bucks for this and the amp. Let me show you the amp. Here's the amp. It's a 15 watt amp. I thought it was 30. I believe it's 15. Because it 
it says BA15 right there volume treble bass you got the treble and the bass sit right in the middle volume as well so it doesn't get too too loud Hollinger made in China everything's made in China so uh, this is specifically based on Fafar got a little carrying uh, handle so for 130 bucks I got the 15 watt amp I got a guitar cable very thin super thin get the bass nice and shiny no dings no dents Um, pretty happy with it. Get three uh, different size picks. Probably play with picks. I'm not sure. Got a 58 millimeter. Got a 81 millimeter. And a 1.2 millimeter. This would be more for the base because it's a lot, um, a lot thicker. Also with the base came the strap. You'll notice that there is a strap on my base. It is not the strap that came with it. This is seatbelt material from the 50s. Uh, yeah, no, I don't like it very much. So I went my Sam Ash. Picked up a much nicer and longer strap fits way better um much more comfortable much softer material and yeah can't go wrong with comic book um again uh not very good uh <laughs> at least not yet takes practice i'm 40 old dog learn new tricks and all um but yeah should be fun oh also came with a uh, handy dandy uh, Davidson specifically a uh, little chart tells you what strings are what tells you what notes are where on the fret describes uh, well ins and outs of your bass pretty happy with that tells you how to tune it and all um, it's a little cheat sheet to learn it on but overall for the money, for the money, it's a pretty darn good bass. And, uh, definitely got to practice. But, um, uh, there you go. So, have a good one. Talk to you soon. That's my review. Uh, Davidson. Davidson Base on Amazon. <laughs>